My name is Mark Humphreys with Lincoln Electric Cutting Systems and today we're going to explain how to find the right plasma cutter for your Torchmate CNC plasma cutting table. When choosing your plasma cutter, you must consider two things. What thickness of material you'll be cutting and what source of electrical power is at your disposal. Knowing these two things will define the amperage of plasma cutter that is right for you. Most residential homes have some source of 220 volt single phase electrical power. Your dryer is probably hooked up to this type of electrical outlet. This is compatible with any plasma cutter between 40 and 100 amps. Whichever model of plasma cutter you select within that range will then determine the maximum thickness of material you'll be able to cut. Commercial buildings offer a second source of electrical power that expands your conventional plasma cutting beyond 100 amps. It's a three phase electrical configuration that allows you to cut one inch thick mild steel while still maintaining a fairly good duty cycle and longevity and consumables. You may still plug in your lower amperage plasma cutter into your three phase electrical outlet if you don't have any single phase available. If you have any more questions about which plasma cutter you should choose, feel free to give us a call to talk with a sales representative today.